Okay, so about one week ago, um, I went by the uh, repurposed project, which is on Waldo Road down, uh, it's in Gainesville, and um, I found this. This here, and I didn't know what it was to begin with, I played around with it some and researched some of it, but it's actually, and you can see it, it says a uh, ranging optimeter 120. So um, this is like a, um, a range finder to measure certain things. Uh, now it's in meters, not in feet, and but it's also manual, like no electronics. It's like an old thing, like from like I guess like the 60s. I guess that's my guess, the 60s. I couldn't figure out when it came out. Um, but yeah, this is all in meters, and um, there's the meters thing right there in the bottom, um, uh, bottom right corner, right there, and um, the knob you use to adjust the meters, and then one price tag on the bottom for five dollars. I got it for five bucks, and it works just fine actually. Well, actually, there's there's a, I think it works. It does actually work. Um, there's a I think a, a weak spring or something in there that's sometimes gets kind of in a bind or whatever and you have to kind of like shake it and it'll uh, fix itself so what is a meter a meter is um, really close to a yardstick it is um, three feet and 3.75 inches long so just a little over a yardstick um, and so this thing has a range from two meters to 30 meters so what that means is that I can measure something from six feet and 6.74 inches to 98 feet and 5.102 inches which is actually almost 100 feet which is pretty good actually um, so now the conversion if you want to convert or just a conversion uh, equation that uh, you can use is that whatever meter you have so like x meters times 3.28084 equals your uh, number of feet you have so like if I have 5 meters so I'll do 5 times 3.28084 and that would give me 16 feet and 4.85 inches 4.85 inches in case you're wondering why i'm looking down i have this uh, notes right here so <laughs> there we go so at any time i'm hoping that i can show this through camera um it's got a very tiny view hole very tiny view view hole right there on the very on the side right there and so I don't know how easy it's going to be for the camera to pick it up, um, but I'm going to try to, to show the camera how it looks to measure something. I have no idea if you can see that. This is kind of hard to do, but um, that is 6.85 meters away. It's my phone's flashlight. You, if you can't see that, you should be able to see a yellow frame and like a regular color frame. It's, it's actually on my ladder over there, on the ladder. So, you should be able to see at least a yellow frame and a regular frame. Now, as far as seeing the flashlight, I don't know if you can see that or not, but that is 6.8, uh, 5 meters away. So there's the meters right there, the meter symbol right there. And it's right now at 6.85. And you can turn it this way, or you can turn it back the other way. Anywhere between 2 and 30, you can turn it to. Now, when I get to the end, okay, when I get, when I get 2 meters, right there, 2 meters. And see, there's nothing, el nothing else to the left of it. Um, but yeah, that's how that looks. And so here's the. The top says ranging optimeter. Now that there is actually the yellow frame. So if I'm looking through on this side right here, all I've seen is just the clear regular color image on the other side. Over here is the yellow frame. So what happens is that um, light or the image will enter this side and go right to you. Light will come in through here and somehow gets reflected back over to here, back out the eyepiece right there. So that's what creates the double image, the double frame. And so you have to turn this wheel right here to adjust. I guess there's a meter, I mean a mirror in there somewhere that, that kind of rotates. And so I guess you have to turn this wheel right there to orient the mirror for the both frames to be lined up. Um, yeah, I have no idea where the uh, the uh, what year this is from I don't see there's a uh, a um, I don't know if you can see it or not there's a price tag up there the mo the uh, model number says made in USA 
by Ranging Inc. Pat number 3817621. And I've done some research. I found where people are selling these things on, on um, eBay and Amazon. Or well, eBay mainly. There you go. You can kind of see the yellow frame. It's right there. Yeah. Um, but with that being said, have a good one and take it away, Hayden. Have a great day. Be seeing you.